안녕하세요, everyone. This is Gia. Welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be making small batch spring kimchi. The brining method is quick and the fermentation process only lasts for a few hours to one day. The recipe is easy and it tastes light, juicy, and refreshing. Let's get started. Discard just a few tough outer leaves from cabbage and you're gonna set aside. Cut the napa cabbage lengthwise in half, then cut each half again, making quarters. Cut out the core, then cut the leaves into two inch squares that are as uniform as possible. Rinse the leaves in cold water three to four times. Let's drain the liquid. Add the cabbage leaves in a large bowl. Add anchovy fish sauce, and this is seoja, the salty shrimp. We omit the process of salting the cabbage. Instead, we will brine them in the fish sauce. Toss well and put the outer leaves of the cabbage on the top. Put something heavy on the top like this, and let it stand it at room temperature for about 30 minutes. Meanwhile, let's prep the seasoning and stuffing. Cut the green onion into inch-sized pieces. Adding a little bit of fruit such as Asian pear or apple, balance the taste of kimchi. Peel a quarter of Asian pear. Cut into chunks and we'll also need half of medium-sized onion. A few cloves of garlic and ginger. These chilies are in the medium heat index and they're earthy. If you cannot get the same chilies, I recommend to use one red bell pepper instead. Adding fresh chili to this kimchi makes it very refreshing. The cabbage has been salted in fish sauce for 30 minutes. Turn it over so that the cabbage leaves get evenly brined. Put this aside again. Now we want to blend the veggies all together. Add onion, chilies, pear, garlic, and ginger into the blender. This is plum syrup, meshre. Okay, we're going to pulse a few times and then blend until smooth. Take off the cover leaves and pour the seasoning mixture. Add Korean chili flakes, salt, and toss it well. Korean chili peppers are less spicy than the tropical variety used in Southeast Asia cooking or Mexican varieties. Add some green onion and lightly toss them. Kimchi can range from a fresh jasmine kimchi to a carefully aged stage. There are hundreds of different types of kimchi and tons of different recipes for kimchi. Spring kimchi is one of my favorite. Let me taste one bite. It's crunchy, juicy, tangy, so yummy. Thank you for watching. See you again.